Hello friends and welcome to this question solving session on multiplexers. In this we will see many questions that has been asked previously in gate examination as well as some of the other questions that will help to clear your concept. So let's take first question which was asked for 1 marks in gate 2014 in EC. In this question we have to find out the function being implemented by these two multiplexers and this given set of input. So we know function of a multiplexer. So if we can write it down in terms of AND and OR. We are getting input W here and W bar. So if this output function is A, that will be W S1 bar, W bar S1. Similarly, this input is applied here and here we will get A bar. So F will be A dot S2 bar plus A bar dot S2. So this is nothing but W XOR S1 and this will be A XOR S2. Now if we put value of A that will be W XOR S1 XOR S2. So our option D is correct. Moving on to next question. This question was asked for one marks in gate 2011. Again we have to find out the function being implemented here. This point is shown as ground so this is logic 0. So this 0 is applied here. We are getting 1 here and again 1 here. and 0 here. So if we write down function that will be 0 dot p bar q bar plus 1 dot p q bar plus 1 dot p bar q plus 0 dot p q. So we are left with p q bar plus p bar q this will be p x or q so again our option d is correct you will notice this pattern in uh, several other questions this pattern generates a uh, xor gate okay you can keep that in mind moving on to next question this was asked for 2 marks in gate 2010. Again we have to find out the function. So again we can write down equations. We are getting input C here, D here and C bar here and C bar this will be D bar. This is C bar dot D bar. If we write down equation for this this will be c dot a bar b bar plus d dot a bar b plus c bar a b bar plus c bar d bar a b. Now the given options are in mean terms. So we need to write it down in sum of product form that will be a bar b bar c d plus d bar plus a bar b c plus c bar d plus a bar sorry sorry this will be a b bar c bar d plus d bar plus a b c bar d bar so we can see here what we are getting this is 0 0 1 1 plus 0 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 0 1 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 0 
वन वन जीरो जीरो सो दिस इज थ्री दिस इज टू दिस इज सेवन दिस इज फाइव दिस इज नाइन दिस इज एट दिस इज ट्वेल्व सो टू थ्री टू थ्री फाइव सेवन इज देयर एट इज देयर नाइन इज देयर ट्वेल्व इज देयर सो अवर ऑप्शन डी इज करेक्ट मूविंग ऑन टू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर दिस वॉज आस्क फॉर टू मार्क्स इन गेट टू थाउजेंड सिक्स अगेन वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द इम्प्लीमेंटेड फंक्शन एफ सो इफ वी राइट डाउन इक्वेशन फॉर दिस पॉइंट सपोज दिस इज ए दिस विल बी एक्स डॉट सेट बार प्लस वाई बार डॉट सेट एंड दिस ए इज अप्लाइड हियर सो एफ विल बी ए डॉट वाई प्लस एक्स डॉट सॉरी ए डॉट वाई बार एक्स डॉट वाई इफ यू पुट वैल्यू ऑफ ए एक्स डॉट सेट बार वाई बार प्लस वाई बार डॉट सेट वाई बार प्लस एक्स डॉट वाई सो दिस विल बी एक्स वाई बार सेट बार z dot y bar plus x y. If we take x common from these two, y x z bar y bar z y bar z is here here x z bar is here then x y so option a is correct in this question again we have to find out x so if you remember this pattern 0 1 1 0 input this gives us output as xor of the select lines that will be a xor b or you can work that out again by writing the equations so this is select line for another multiplexer so again the same input pattern is there so the output x will be xor of the select lines so s1 xor s0 that will be nothing but a xor b xor c we need to expand this a b bar plus a bar b dot c bar plus a b bar plus a bar b whole bar dot c that will be a b bar c bar a bar b c bar plus a b bar bar dot a bar b bar dot c this term will be a bar plus b a plus b bar dot c that will be this a dot a bar this is a bar dot a will get cancelled a bar b bar c plus b a c this again b dot b bar will get cancelled so we have terms a b bar c bar here i can see then a bar b c bar again a bar b bar c plus a b c so our option a is correct question number 6 this question was asked for one marks in gate 2005 so what is the function we are getting here c dot b bar plus c bar b 
and here we will get 0 dot e bar plus a dot e so this will vanish a dot e means a dot c b bar plus a c bar b a b bar c plus a b c bar ok option a is correct that's it for this lecture if you have any doubt or suggestion or if you came across any question that you don't understand or you want us to solve it please write to us thank you